It's gonna be alright. Yes, yes, hello. Priscilla? How are you? I'm doing well here. Uh, yeah, uh, good, good. Uh, actually, no, not, not very good. Oh, no, that's so terrible, Harry. Well, good luck. <laughs> Wait, no, no, no. I need your help, actually. <laughs> You're bringing a very different tone to this casual catch-up. I'm, I'm standing at the property. Good for you. Yeah, it's just a little bit more run down than you had me believe. Well, it's been abandoned and neglected, Harry. I mean, join the dots, really. Yeah, but the materials you sent me... Well, I wasn't going to go all the way there to get new photos, was I? I mean, what a waste of my time. So, we're going to learn a little bit about subtropics, which means it gets humid, it rains a lot, and it's sweaty. Mum, is this our new home? Oh, sweetheart. Home is where the heart is. So not. Um, but the caretaker? Yep. Neil. Well, has he been taking any care? No, definitely not. I mean, it's likely that he's done more damage. I mean, he sold the copper out of the main building, so you'll find the lights don't work. And he stole the third structure completely. So I have no idea how he did that. And then he changed the gazebo into a chicken house. Oh, there's chickens? No. OK, well, is there a number I can call? 12. No, no, to call him on. He runs off satellite phone number 12, according to our records, but his brother and Ron himself are the only ones who have the security code. Is there any way I can, I can talk to this Ron that I'm leasing off? He's currently in a Nordic glass igloo, so it's like 3pm over there. I would just say it's probably best for you to wait until he finds you. <laughs> OK, well, good luck now. Yeah, whatever you do, just don't mention the moon landing. Or do. <laughs> wait, no, 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 Priscilla. She hung up on me. Okay. I've run out of power. Let's go find a power outlet that might work here while your father kick dances things in the general area. Stay close. Don't touch anything, especially you. Hey, buddy, you gotta kick those cones. You're gonna have to bite them off me. Sorry, man. I, I didn't realize they belonged to Graham's Driving School for Toddlers. Not anymore. My offer's serious. I'm flat broke. Not a huge market for small children driving lessons. The market's huge. The issue was my wife. Right, sure wasn't uh, being set up next to this giant eyesore. Definitely my wife. Just not a fan. Never start a small business in an unknown town in an industry you know nothing about if you want to stay married. Uh, thanks. Great. It's good to know. You look like a smart guy. I'm sure you'll do things better than I did. Sorry if you uh, get any aggressive three-year-olds around the place. Some of them didn't take it too well. Right, uh, angry children, multiple marriage breakdowns. Since we're on the negatives, um, do you know I could find the caretaker? Oh, Neil? I wouldn't worry about it. I'll find you. Harry! Harry! There's a squatter! A squatter! All right, Tim, so his name is Neil, and he's either faintly for or against the moon landing. I, too, disagree with the live broadcast of the moon landing. How dare they lie to us? It's Harry, this doesn't feel safe. I'm sure it's fine. How harmful could he be? <laughs> ah! OK, new tactic. Childrenless. Childrenless. Viral material. Yes, I understand that, Priscilla. Harry, I'm just going to take him to the library. OK, but he doesn't seem very cooperative. Can you blame him? It's his home, and he didn't know you were coming. What do you mean he didn't know I was coming? I've been away for a week, and I sent him a text, but I guess he didn't get it because the whole no phone thing. So, I don't know, I guessed he was out wilderness bear hunting for adult scouts and he doesn't pay rent, you see, so I just kind of forgot about him. 
Okay, what do you want me to do with that then? Just be kind to him. I'll have Ron send a sonar pulse to his satellite phone. But just treat him like a big wounded bison who is very unpredictable, can use a crossbow and is deeply triggered by the mention of the events of Labor Day 2003. Okay, so nice catching up. Penny, I need you to find out everything you can about Gumdale, Labor Day, 2003. Oh, hi, Pam. No, no, I thought I was calling Penny. Um, yeah, no, the, the kids are fine. Hey, look, now's not a great time. Yes, yes, no, I did hear about the 50 people at the open house. No, 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 really, you don't need to put him on. Hi, Jim. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Yeah, it's probably just a software update. Mom? Yes? This isn't year two curricula. Researching history is important at any age, including your 30s. If we know stuff about the past, we can make better decisions about the future. How bloody great is cricket? Not that one. Where's your brother? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm so sorry. Honey, honey. Neil, I'm not a threat. I just want to talk to you. No, you don't. You want my home. It's my home too, Neil. I'm renting it. I live here. I have for years. Mum just needs two minutes. Oh, excellent. Year two geography. Read this one to your brother, please. Oh, it was a great hiking spot. Oh, no, that's from 1996. Uh, ooh, maps. Go for it. Okay. Okay. May 3rd, May 4th, May 5th, Labor Day. The fall of the Pottoman Empire. Ceramic anarchy at Hoskins Nursery. Bingo. What? Article removed? That can't be good. Oh, Bo! He's not my kid. Oh, Billy. And you know, they're the first ones to take over after all these years. No, mm. but that caretaker's there. I know. And after everything that happened. Mm. The marriage breakdown? Yep. And those angry bikers. The poles. All the mysterious things no one seems to talk about. Exactly. We know, but no one talks about it, so they mustn't know. Mm. Well, if only they did know, mm. I wouldn't touch that property. Mm -hmm. It's ruined so many people's lives. Oh, well, yes. Jeremy. Stop it. Exactly. <laughs> I just hope they're not one to ignore good gossip. That's right. Mm. Neil, how'd the old nursery close? I can't. I don't want to. Just, just, you. You stay out of my way and I'll stay out of yours. <laughs> so did you find out anything more about Labor Day? It is a different date in each state. Did you learn anything else at the library? Nothing concrete. What about those ladies on the ground you were listening to? How did you and uh, the caretaker go? Neil. Neil. Uh, taken care of. Great. Yep, won't be a problem. Obstacle removed. I think that place was his home and it was tragically destroyed. Won't happen again. Yeah, no, same place. Different people. Right, we're not the couple in the chalk drawing. No. What? <clears throat> Why do I have two minute noodles and Ezra has a roast? <laughs> Be careful, please. Okay, this way. You and me, buddy. 
doing in a hole, honey? I don't know. Maybe it's a visual representation of my life right now. Mom, you missed it. We took our nail. You did what? It's all taken care of. I thought you already took care of it. A roof fell on me. A roof? Well, a, a, a panel. Relax. Relax. <laughs> I'm sorry, honey. I can't take you seriously in that hole. I'm on Neil's team right now. I found a bag of snow. Bag of snow? Ooh, give me that. Thank you. It was next to the dead cat. Yeah, it must have been left over from the... Bikies? Honey, we gonna say bikies? Bikies? Like the toddler ones next door? Actual bikies. Something happened here, Harry, and you made an impulsive decision before knowing the facts. This is not just a once famous nursery, and this is no place to raise children. Look, I can see you're upset, so we'll come back later. Come on, guys. Harry, don't you dare leave me in this hole. <sighs> I wanna go home. Okay, we'll get you out of the hole. It's pizza night. But hopefully Ezra's dad ordered extra. No, I want to go home home. <laughs> really? Back to Sydney? Yes, I am interested. I'll be right in. <laughs> Daddy, it's starting. Are you letting me down again? Coming, little beanbag. Don't forget that turnout. I just saw my daughter dance. Nice. You got kids? No. Sorry, yes, I do. Do they dance? Not well. Harry. Yes. Priscilla. Oh, hi. Um, it's nice to meet you in person. Yeah, you seemed um younger and less balding on the phone. Uh, well, you seemed less pregnant. Little quiz time. A large flat area of land. A plain. A narrow valley with steep sides caused by erosion. The hole you fell into yesterday? Okay. Real answer, please. A canyon. Very good. Mom. Yeah. I think we should fill in that hole and plant a veggie patch. Oh, sweetheart. I want to grow my own tomatoes like Ezra and Junus's grandma. And Dad says that nursery has few tiles. That's So with good water retention, which I have learned is important. Ah. Bless you. I will sell the tomatoes with 200% markup, so I will buy stage props. OK, will you now? What kind of stage props? OK, let's go into Ron's office now. Ha! Huh. Hoskins. Like the old nursery. A coincidence. Yeah, what a coincidence that he named a nursery after his own name. <laughs> what? Harry, if you're having a stroke, the local number's triple zero. That's the number for the whole country. You mean to tell me that Ron is Ron Hoskins from Hoskins Nursery? I thought you knew Mr. Hoskins still owned a nursery. Does this look like the face of someone that knew that? Harry, we've only just met. So for all I know, this could be your regular face. 
thought Ron's last name was Nor. Ron Nor Inc. Oh my god, is Nor just Ron backwards? Don't be so ridiculous. It stands for no other Ron. Anyway, I don't know why this information changes anything. Ron and Shirley... Oh, chalk drawings. They couldn't look after the nursery anymore following... Epitaph. Well, that and other confirmed sinister things. OK, you know what? This doesn't concern me anymore. The man from the toddler driving school next to your property was right. Graham. Mmm. Great product. Terribly unsupportive wife. This is just far too big of a risk to put the people I love. You're different to the others. <laughs> yeah, I'll really miss these casual catch-ups and rescind my baby shower invitation. <sighs> Excellent. Uh, we can enter now. Hi, excuse me. Do you know that man? Oh, yes. Neil and his brother have been coming here for years. Oh, he's been through so much. That's the third time that he's rented out how to emotionally untie yourself from former employment trauma. I just heard he's a little bit unstable. Oh, no. Just misunderstood. OK. I wouldn't buy into any gossip around here. Quick question. What kind of clearance does someone need to remove an article from public records? Um... Hypothetically. OK. Let us begin. Uh, oh, where's Mr Hoskins? Oh, knowing Ron, probably sipping a sangria portside. He's in Barcelona, remember? Ah, uh, no, I'm pretty sure you didn't mention that on the phone. Ah, uh, yes, I definitely did. Because I take any opportunity to say Barcelona like a Spanish person. Bath, ba... Bath, bath, Barcelona. Mm, that was nice. Um, you said he was on the foreshore. Yeah, of Spain. Thank you again, Steve. Sorry about the other day. Um, we are new to the area. The kids were overwhelmed. It's a big place. He seems like a regular bookshelf tipper. He knows what's going on. Do you know anywhere around here that's good for lunch? Kid friendly? Maybe food, maybe sheep. Maybe sheep? Sheep. Well, we used to, but not anymore. Redlands is a good spot, but it is missing a community landmark for families. Maybe a bite to eat. Maybe some plants. Who doesn't love plants? Oh, and pots. You really need something to put the plants in. Sounds a lot like the place Dad wants to open. Yes, I'm hearing it. Really, quite vividly, we have somewhere to be. Steve, it's been... Uh, yeah, I, we gotta go. Ron or no Ron? It's no other Ron. This was not the place it was advertised to me, and it's no place to raise children. And one of them fell in the hole, didn't they? My wife did. Look, Harry, I completely understand. Of course, you can pull out of this lease. Um, let me just... Oh... No... Sorry. What's the problem? I'm within the calling off period. Look, October 6th, and today's the 16th of... Yeah, of course. Yeah, if it was an Australian dated contract. I, why wouldn't it be? Because Ron was in America at the time of signing, so it's actually an American dated contract. Yeah, but it's an Australian contract. Well, it was actually drafted in Uruguay. So you could say it's a South American contract. Yeah. No, 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 no. This is... Contractual interference, and I learned that from CSI. OK, um, can we just check? Is that, is that your signature? Oh, damn it. Yeah. Oh, Harry. I could have helped you if it was the 16th of June. <sighs> what am I going to tell Penny? OK, OK, just, um, yeah, if you could just ponder your feelings outside. I'm not, I'm not very good with other people's emotions. Oh, no, just can't take your emotions outside. I'm not... No. Just stop. Stop. Oh, 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 that's not gonna... Stop. No, no, no. Oh, thanks. OK. Harry, sure. Harry, wait, Penny. wait, 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 wait. Did you trash this woman's office? Yeah, I, I did. <laughs> that's so romantic. What's with all the Batman photos? I don't know. I just realised that. It's so weird. Ron likes to think of himself as Batman. Is that the original Val Kilmer suit? Yeah, it is. He had it on for three months straight. Sucked him in like a cryovac. I, I, I couldn't get out of the lease. 
Harry, it doesn't matter if you skimped on paying a lawyer because you make impulsive decisions that pay off 60% of the time. And now it's come crashing down. Wow, she knows you really well. Let's do this. What? Are you serious? Yeah. That property with your ideas, it was the old owners that were the problem. And everyone else to do with the nursery. Harry, the community need this. And we need this. There is something I need to say. Whatever it is, it doesn't matter. I back you, I back us. Guys, you actually don't have a choice. You will fill in that hole. Yeah, we're we'll growing tomorrow. Okay. I don't care. We have work to do. We do. We have work to do. But not before a Venom family dance okay. party. Okay. Come on, honey, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're still listing off these people and I kind of want them to respect us. Yes, good. Henry. Priscilla. Henry. I think he thinks he's Batman. Oh my gosh, what was that? I'm sure it has nothing to do with us. Okay. You, you are right next to me all this time. Okay, well you, you've got to warn me. You've got 20 to... years I have waited to take this property. I will expand my horticultural empire and I'll destroy you like the last people who ran this nursery. I'm sorry, what was that? Hmm? Um, I don't know, it just sounded like you said that you're gonna destroy them like you did the last people that ran the nursery. Well, that's, that's just ridiculous. I definitely did not say that. Okay. Well, he's very reactionary. I mean, he just referred to my ficus as a philodendron. So I don't see this whole thing working out anyway. <laughs> and little owls. Oh, hey, it's winning. Uh, what are you doing here? I thought we'd have lunch together. <gasps> yeah. Some Dale Baker? Actually, I got a different idea. Come with me! Okay, okay. everyone I, stop, everyone stop. I, okay, I, now open your eyes. Okay. Oh! <laughs> But wait, there's more, there's oh, more. Yes, follow more? me, follow me. I think that's gonna melt. I thought this is where you could teach him. The more falling bookshelves. I love it. I have something else I wanna show you. Okay. Come on, guys. Yep. Oh, wow. Did you paint that? No, obviously not. No, it was here from before. I just cleaned it up. Why are our belongings here? I solved all of our problems. I found us a place to live. Surprise! No. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, we're not. Now we have facilities and each other. No. And, and no young or old Ezra. We, there is no way we're living here. Hello? Uh, we're not open yet. Hello. Uh, yes, we see you not open, but uh, we were rather hoping that you were. You know, the citizen shambles. What do you uh, want? We need jobs. Oh, great, great. Uh, uh, what do you do? Well, I am a fully qualified garden centre manager from the UK. And I'm a chef from, from Vietnam. Both, both. She's amazing. Great, okay. Uh, Resumes? Uh, Here, well, I'll give you one anyway. And there are some referees on the back there, real numbers, you can call them. And I will cook for you, and you'll see. Um, can you start Monday? Uh, That's today. today. We'll see you tomorrow, Tuesday. T tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. Okay. Tomorrow? I will come tomorrow, but no plans. I just cook. Yeah, um, we actually don't have a cafe yet. Yeah. That, it's like in the pipeline. It's fine. Hm. I'll wait. Yes. Hmm. Yeah. Did you want to interview us or...? No, I trust you, yeah. yeah. English people never lie, so... Please attend my classes. Well, uh, see you tomorrow. You've got a lot of work to do. Pip-pip! 
Sorry, I've never said that before in my life, but yes. Tomorrow. Huzzah! Don't tell them about our cash flow issue. Don't tell them about your visa problem. Ah, yes. I am still processing this. It's a temporary solution, Pen. Wait, no, 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 no. Um, that bathroom isn't functioning. <laughs>